Welcome to the BNDAR booth at Interpark 2023, where we are happy to present automation solution for the future of personalized packaging, introducing you to the adaptive manufacturing. The world of packaging is changing fast. How do you handle shorter product life cycles and growing demand for personalization? How do you stay competitive by reducing production costs and machine footprint? My name is Vladi Martino and I'm going to show you how automation is helping to answer these questions and shape the future of the packaging industry. With the broadest automation portfolio on the market, BNDR offers the right solution for consumer packaged goods industry. The tight synchronization of each BNDR product gives machine builders an edge in performance and quality. Our commitment to open standards unlocks digitalization and integration for any advanced features for machines and factories. And it all comes together in a single software environment with easy access to all products and technologies through the full machine life cycle from engineering, development, deployment, diagnostic and maintenance. What happens when you combine our track and 6D product transport systems with robotics, vision and digital twins? This is where you, it gets really interesting, especially for packaging. With the trend toward e-commerce, direct-to-consumer and omni-channel strategies, there is an increasing variety of products and batch sizes. Product life cycles are getting shorter and shorter. You can't predict what new product you will need to make in the years to come. With the right combination of automation technology, you can gain the power of adaptive manufacturing. Production lines that adapt on the fly to the needs of each product with an amazing OEE performance. Profitable mass customization and the ability to get future products to the market extremely fast. No downtime wasted on mechanical changeover and no floor space wasted on empty conveying. The key to all this is a shift in thinking about how processes are organized. That's what it means to think adaptive. What does adaptive manufacturing actually look like? Here, we combine two track loops with two vision systems, robotics and simulation, all managed by a single controller and programmed in a single engineering tool. On the process loop, we see an adaptive line doing inspection and sorting at full production speed. The shutters carry two different kinds of products and switch tracks on the fly thanks to the magnetic diverter. Spacing between products is adjusted dynamically to manage different product sizes and coordinate cycle times, boosting productivity. Look, even at full speed, the cameras are synchronized at one microsecond and the robot tracks product perfectly. On the pit lane, we see shutters being tracked and hot swapped by the robot without stopping production, thanks to the tight synchronization between track and robot. New shuttle enter production flow with no human intervention. They are recognized automatically with a unique ID, enabling continuous tracking of mileage and other data for predictive maintenance. And really perfect for today's iMix productions, we see dynamic grouping and rainbow packaging you have full flexibility to manufacture different products at the same time on the same line. You have no sequential processing, allowing fully customized treatment of each and every item. You can package any combination with no downtime and no mechanical setup. Amazing things are possible with independent control of each product on a linear truck system. Here, we take that a step farther with a plan and levitating transport system. Now, imagine what you can do with six degrees of freedom in an open processing space. Acopo 60 shuttle can lift, tilt, spin, move together in a convoy, even all at the same time. Let's look at how floating independent shuttles unlock efficiency in packaging applications like uh, filling, capping and labeling. We see multiple SKUs moving freely between stations with different processing times in an adaptive way. Each shuttle moves to the next process station on demand when the station says it is ready. This allows dynamic buffering for optimized cycle time and footprint. 
the shuttles perform tasks that would normally require other equipment. The weight on the shuttle is known in every moment, so there is no need for external sensor or scales. And you can also move on CNC profile for processing requiring high precision and repeatability, like marking, printing or sealing. No need for complex kinematic. The shuttle does all the work, moving below simple and static process station that cost less and demand lower maintenance. Anti-sloshing increases productivity and reduces waste and cleaning. The shuttle has a unique ID, recognized automatically by the system, and the site, the camera reads the QR code on the product to allow full track and trace capability. With simple communication, you get complete traceability of each personalized product. We see how products are personalized and sorted dynamically, and we can follow along real time on the HMI with a live digital twin simulation. Importantly, we see how small of a footprint is needed to do all these things. Now, what about if you have hygienic constraints like in food and beverages or pharmaceuticals? Then, the new washdown shutter bring all the same functionality to this application too. This perfectly complements the rest of being their hygienic products, including operator panels, servo motors and robotics. Let's focus on product personalization with a real machine from leading Japanese cosmetic producer, Kao. This is a truly the future of personalized cosmetics, but the same approach can easily be applied to all types of different industries. The product here is a makeup powder. What this station does is create custom 3D artwork right in the powder. The artwork picture can come from consumer or from a collaboration with a famous designer or artist. You can add really incredible individual value to the products. How does it work? To create the beautiful images, each makeup cases moves on a 6D shuttles below stationary nozzles to create delicate and beautiful images in two colors. The shuttles control line thickness and shading simply by changing their speed and their height. What Cows has done is achieve profitable bed size one and a shorter time to market for a definite competitive edge. Profitable personalization. This is something they could not do with conventional technology but becomes really easy with Acopos 6D. They can now change design on the fly without stopping production and you see the tiny amount of full space needed. It is also easy to add more station so the system scales almost infinitely. It completely switches conventional thinking about the design of personalized processing equipment to an adaptive thinking. Where to start to implement an adaptive design? Reduce the time to market of the machines and bring competitive advantage to the manufacturers? B and there will be with you all the way as we believe in the importance of co-creation and the value it brings to our customers. At co-creation labs around the world, BNDR builds bridges between research, development and application to transform the latest advancements in automation into competitive advantage for our customers. Experiment with new technology, simulate machine designs, perform proof of concept, validation and prototyping. There are many ways to unlock the full potential of your know-how together with the BNDR experts. The bottom line is, Together, we accelerate development and reduce risk to get the best solution for your needs into operation quickly and easily. As you can see, the BNDR Booth technology offers many chances to step into the future of personalized packaging. And BNDR customers are building that future as we speak. All across Interpack, they are showcasing more than 20 adaptive solutions powered by BNDR automation technology. If you are ready to inspire your customers and bring the future of packaging into your application, it's time to think adaptive.